Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, I hope you and your families are all nice and safe. Still indoors, obviously, but uh, we'll make the best of a bad job. Just thought I'd do a quick video on photo mechanic. I've had a few questions lately on captioning, uh, text files, how I make the text file, where I get the team sheet from, if you like, where I grab it offline. So just thought I'd open photo mechanic and we'll go through it and I'll show you how I set up. Oh, intro on its way. Let me know what you think. Right, so I've got four images here that I can use as examples of how I caption, but first off I'm going to make a text file. So open text edit. Now I get my teams from a website called Football Squads, and they, they cover from Premier League down to National League, which is great. So just for instance, we've got a Premier League game and we've got Arsenal. Let's go for the first one. So I copy the whole team. So put my cursor over one. I hold the Alt key down and just copy the whole team down to the last player. Command C, copy that, and then back to my text file and Command V to paste in there. So that's that pasted in. Now what I do next is, obviously we don't need any of this text here, so up to this, obviously we can't go in here and do a batch delete because it might chop off a few names. So I'm going to go take the cursor there, holding the Alt key down, and then just go as far out as we need to. So to that last one where it says Borussia Dortmund, and then down to the end, delete. So that's all that gone. And then same again, Alt key, delete, delete these bits, and so on. We can go right down now probably, yep. Delete them. Right, and then same again in here, holding the Alt key down just to highlight the areas where we need deleting. A little bit tedious this is. There might be another way, guys. If there is, please drop us a line on the comments and uh, let me know, because I might be doing it a proper Heath Robinson way here. Right, so that's that done. We've got rid of all that. Now, one important thing that I got taught some time ago, as in Hector Bellerin here, these, uh, I don't know what they are. They're not they're not uh, our letters anyway, but I don't know what you call these bits on top of letters, can't remember. But anyway, so we need to change them for standard letters. So Hector Bellerin, apparently it doesn't show up so well on searches. Same again with Ozil. No. And then just, oh, there's quite a few here. Look, so we've got Cedric Soares, Nicholas Pepe. Keep going down, I might miss one. Loads. Right, that's that sorted. So next. Uh, obviously, this is Arsenal, so we want to put an A, which is going to help us for our captions, at the start of every number. Now, this is where it gets a bit Heath Robinson. I did think you could go into text edit, which I'll show you in a bit once we've made this file. So, we want an A next to all these now. So, all I do is type A and then use the arrow keys. which is a bit monotonous. Again, I'm sure there is a better way to do it than this. And again, please drop us a line in the comments if you know, because I've looked at the find and replace method in the text edit, but it doesn't do a proper job. Right, so that's that done, so we've got the A's for Arsenal, obviously. Now, we have to fill this in, Arsenal's, and then I just, again, I just copy, copy, and then make my way down the list and just fill that in. Right, 
and that's that done. So now I've got my tech sheet. Obviously, let's just go down one. I want Arsenal Manager. So AM and then tab along. Let's just go back and copy his name, Arteta. So copy that, copy back into the text file. So Control V for Michael Arteta, and then I'm just going to copy that to there. And then manager. Arsenal manager, Michael Arteta. Right, obviously Bernard Leno is goalkeeper. So Arsenal goalkeeper. Now, what I sometimes do if I don't know the teams, go back into there, and then obviously just go down and look up for all the G's. So 26, 33, 26, 33. That'll do because the others aren't going to play. 26, 26, copy that, 26, 33, just double check, Matt Macy, and what was it on, 26, Emiliano Martinez, Matt Macy, just double check that, Matt Macy, the other G, Emiliano. I think we did see another G down here somewhere, but James Hilson. So 76, 76 and 63. 76. And 63. So that's that done now. So that's them teams done. I know when I hit my forward slash A11, it'll bring up Lucas Torreira. So next, I will put my presets in. I'm not going to put the other team in, because so you've seen how I do that. So presets, I've obviously got on a different, a different text file. So I'm just going to copy these presets. Copy it down to there. And then down to the last player. Hit it and then control uh, command V and there we are and I've got all sorts of them as you can see sprints forward with the ball SF penalty is awarded a penalty prepares for the match receives a yellow card all sorts of presets shouts instructions to his players you know managers whatever clears a loose ball inspects the pitch before kickoff the warm-up stuff celebrates scoring his side's first goal second goal third goal scores his side's first goal second goal third goal all that all his presets for my text file so we've got that in there now so that is now theoretically my text obviously I'll put another team in underneath this so we've got the text file let's just rename it Arsenal jobs are good and close that back into photo mechanic into edit settings code replacements now we need to add that Arsenal text file into here so add I've left it on my desktop there it is double click and it's now in there before we go out of this here's your delimiter character so when I use this for shortcuts I will always put forward slash first and then for instance a1 for the goalkeeper forward slash and it will give me the caption so that's okay, I always use the forward slash. You can use what key you like, but so we'll highlight Arsenal, okay that, and now let's just go on these examples just to double check that the Arsenal file is working. So forward slash A1 forward slash, and there we are. So I know that that's working. So we'll just delete that, we'll cancel that, no. And that's that. Right, into the images. So, we've got our text file, it's in the system, let's have a look at these images. Right, this first one, we've got three players that are involved. So we've got Bournemouth Keeper, uh, Ramsdale, we've got Morpé and Francis. So let's see what I've wrote for this. Bournemouth goalkeeper, Aaron Ramsdale, see, good job I check that, look, gathers, always double check your text file, your, your captions, always double check them even if it means another 10 seconds. 
Bournemouth goalkeeper Aaron Ramsdale gathers the ball as Brighton Hove Albion's Neil Morpé looks to challenge with Simon Francis closing in. That's what I would have for that. And then vital that we put person shown in this box. So all I do is copy the lot, copy, paste, and then just delete the words you don't want. Delete that. And then delete that bit there. Jobs are good. So we've got all three names now in there and that's what I would do. And then obviously send. So let's go to the next one. What's the next one? Uh, changes, yeah, let's make changes, yeah. Right, so we've got Callum Wilson, he's made, he scored the goal, and the only person I'm not going to include in my caption is Billing, because he, he, he's almost irrelevant, really. <laughs> Sorry, Billing. But. Right, so I've got five players here, so obviously, let's have a look what we've put. Bournemouth's Callum Wilson celebrates scoring his size first goal of the match with number nine, because you can see his number, number nine, Dominic Solanke and Harry Wilson. And then I've just emphasised Adam Smith and Simon Francis as Adam Smith high fives captain Simon Francis. And that's that, so that's that's pretty clear really. And again, same thing again. Copy the lot, paste into person shown. Delete that, delete space. So there we are, we've got the person shown and that goal. So that's that one done. Yeah, I'll take that. Right, this next one. Again, you've got to try and remember that it could be someone looking at this image who has not got a clue what is going on. That's why I chose this one. So back to the caption. Referee Kevin Friend instructs Watford's Troy Deeney to move back as Brighton and Hobie Albums David Proper prepares to take a free kick. Pretty self-explanatory for us, really, but you've got to remember, if it did go in a paper, say you got in trouble later on in the game or something, they might crop David Proper out and use this, you know, if, if he was to get in trouble. So, always add as many people as you can. And then again, same thing again. Let's start with Kevin Friend. Copy, paste, and then, you know, delete through this. I shan't do it again, but deleting through that. So, that's another one to show you. And then finally, now here, I've left this frame, I've left this frame quite wide open. Again, papers can square edit that or you know square crop it. But I'm only going to name three here. Ward Prowse, a paper couldn't really do much with that. You've got Captain here, Joyberg, but he couldn't really be used. So I'm just going to name the three individuals here. So Southampton's Jan Bednarak protests as he receives a yellow card. I think protests is a pretty good, accurate way of putting that. So he protests as he receives a yellow card off referee Peter Banks for a rough challenge on Tottenham's Son Hung Ming, and he's down there. And that's how I do that. And then same thing again. Copy, paste into person shown, delete the other bits. Jobs are good and now then, one other thing to show you, let's just get rid of that. Let's go back into our text file. Now if I want to make a change in here, I would make a change, delete that, and then I would go back into Photo Mechanic 5, into Edit, down to Settings, Set Code Replacements. I would highlight that, highlight the text file that I've just altered, and then just reload it. Reload all, and now, okay. So we've changed that text file, we've reloaded it. So if we go in here now, into there, and type in Aubameyang's name, so forward slash A14, it comes up with my changes. And it's quite, so that's how easy it is to change your text file. Jobs are good and well hopefully that's shown you a few tips of how I go about setting up text files and how I caption the frames. Obviously that find and replace in the text, text edit uh, program 
it's good, but it's 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 not good enough. But I bet there is a way there, and I bet you guys know of how to do it. I do it the Heath Robinson way, still using the arrow keys and, indivi and entering individual letters and numbers. But uh, so let me know in the comments below how you do it. We can all gather information on how each other does it, and we'll come up with a good way, hopefully. But uh, jobs are good, and thanks for watching, guys. Be great if you could give it a thumbs up. Awesome if you could hit that subscribe button. Catch up again soon, stay safe.